Hello, I'm David Johnson with ACM Partners. Across the retail sector, we are seeing three very interesting emerging turnaround stories. Electronics retailer Best Buy, department store operator JCPenney, and grocery store operator Super Value are each seeking to adjust sh to shifting market dynamics. Best Buy founder Richard Schultz is seeking to put together an investor coalition to take private his former company. Schultz continues to own a 20% minority stake and has been working with prospective investors for several months. It is clear that Best Buy needs some catalyst for a return to not only growth, but profitability. The company has suffered declining same-store sales for several months and has consistently failed in its bid to develop a comprehensive strategy to adjust to shifting consumer buying patterns. Increasingly, consumers are showing a willingness to purchase big ticket electronics online and Best Buy is simply becoming a showroom for those consumers. JCPenney CEO Ron Johnson has had a challenging past few months. After the company revamped its discounting policy, financial performance was below the market's already subdued expectations. However, there seems to be a silver lining. Recent reports suggest that newly remodeled stores are showing explosive growth. It seems that Johnson might not have lost the retail touch that he showed at both Target and Apple stores. Supermarket operator Super Value has been testing the market for several months, looking to find a buyer, hopefully a buyer of the company as a whole. However, with $6 billion in debt against $150 million in cash on hand, and $2.5 billion of cumulative operating losses over the past two years, it is clear that SuperValue is a motivated seller. Given the fact that SuperValue is a known motivated seller, potential acquirers have no incentive to do anything but cherry pick the very best assets, which is what they seem to be doing. These are Retail Turnarounds in the News, and I'm David Johnson. Thank you.